Mr. William come to see me with severe shoulder pain and stiffness of the right shoulder for eight months. This pain disturbs him a lot. He can't sleep, very painful, and he can't move well. So after examination, we found that he had a lot of pain of right shoulder and stiffness shoulder limit all range of motion. We plan to investigate with film X-ray and the X-ray film show that he has severe osteoarthritis of the right shoulder. According from uh, his history, examination and investigation, we think that he needs to do the surgery and the surgery that the most proper for him is reverse total shoulder arthroplasty. Normally, uh, the operation for the osteoarthritis of the shoulder, we have two methods about the arthroplasty. First is total shoulder arthroplasty. Everything is uh, same for about the mechanical chain only the surface of the bone by the metal to help the surface. But the party and rotator the cup need to be good. Secondly, we will use the new technology. It's called reverse total shoulder arthroplasty. We will chain the surface with the metal, but the mechanic is changed because of mostly in this patient, rotator cup mostly torn and dysfunction. We need to use the deltoid function to help movement instead of rotator cuff because he has history of the rotator cuff torn and repair in the past and maybe had a return of the tendon. So we should reverse total shoulder arthroplasty to solve his problem. This procedure, she need to do the open surgery and chain the normal joint to be more proper mechanical is the reverse total shoulder arthroplasty as the picture that we show. So we aim to decrease the pain and help him to move well in the future. I just bonded with my surgeon the minute I met Dr. Rakapal. And from that point on, everything was smooth, efficient, and easy from the first x-rays and the bone scans and all the pre-testing that had to go on. It was just efficient and each person, each nurse, each doctor put me at ease, total ease, and I felt ready for the operation with total confidence. After surgery, the result is very good. His shoulder pain is decreased a lot and he can sleep well. Mostly, he needs to admit to control pain in a two or three days after surgery. After that, he needs to use the sling about four to six weeks to help the shoulder not move much. And after three days, he can discharge from hospital, follow up the wound at two weeks. The wound is very good and he can move well now. He is very happy about his new right shoulder. Now he don't suffer with the pain at night. He can move up better. I'm very glad about the result. Well, the most amazing thing for me was after the surgery, there was no pain. And that was two weeks ago that I had the surgery. I've had no pain, none at all. I will say this about uh, after the surgery, I went into ICU or actually turned out to be two days because the night of the first day, my blood pressure dropped uh, to critical point and the doctors were able to like give me IVs, blood transfusion and bring it all up to normal within, within one hour. So. I was very thankful and fortunate to have such great doctors around me in the ICU. I would 100% recommend this hospital to anyone in the world. The efficiency has been perfect. The kindness that everyone has shown has been wonderful and everyone is super helpful. So absolutely, I would recommend it for anyone needing quality care and quality um, operations in Bangkok or anywhere in the world to come to this hospital.